the University of Alberta holds a debate between David Schindler and the government scientist responsible for monitoring oil sands impacts, Preston McEachern. There's a perception that the fish are poisoned and uh, we've certainly seen tumored fish. There are contaminants in the system because the river flows through bitumen. We don't disagree that there are impacts. Well, obviously, there are. What we fail to focus on is the relevance of that impact. It can't be none. I mean, the, the city of, of Edmonton has a wastewater discharge. Suncor alone burns a million tons of coke a year. That represents a hell of a lot of toxic elements. Almost any toxic element on the periodic table is in coke. With all of this competing data, how are ordinary citizens able to digest that? I think industry likes it that way. As long as there's confusion, there won't be any regulation. I've seen this with phosphates and detergents, with acid rain, with big tobacco. We're seeing it as we speak with climate. It's a standard industry tactic. Get all sorts of voices so there's a muddle. It appears that the teeter-totter swings. It doesn't tip one way. And every year that you can get away with lack of regulation is a few billion more bucks in your pocket. After 40 years, I'm pretty sick of seeing this tactic fool people time after time. Maybe we all did just fall off a turnip truck. Schindler hopes his research will finally clear the fog of confusion. But will the government listen? <laughs>